Welcome, welcome everybody. I'm Killzomzone, and today I'm going to be doing a, I guess, tutorial. Um, I did something similar to this when it came to Marvel Heroes Omega, where I basically showcased different things. With Heroes Omega, I did basically showcasing different characters. I'm thinking now that I'm going to do a little series where I try to make custom characters on Warframe and then see what you guys think of them. So today is Pennywise. This is honestly, in my opinion, the best way, and yes, I will show you how to make him, at least how I made him here, if you do like him. Um, now, this is personally, in my opinion, the best and easiest way to make Pennywise in this game. Now, you can alter the colors if you want and whatnot. This is just how I did it. You don't have to do it exactly. But if you want it exactly, um, here's what you'll have to do. Saren Helmet, you'll need not the Hemlock. You won't need the Prime, because the Prime looks really weird. You'll need the original Saren. Now, keep in mind, I have Saren Prime, so that's why it kind of looks different than the regular Saren body. As you can see here, Saren Prime skin looks way different than Saren Prime. I mean, I mean, Saren Prime looks way different than Saren skin. So, personally, I think you need to have this animation. Um, makes him, like, more crouchy looking like. Attachments. Now, these are just attachments that I thought would personally look good on it. So... Here they are. The chest piece, I got this from the um, from the Void Trader. This is a Kytir Forest chest play. It looks very nice. Um, then I ended up getting this, the left EOS um, Prime Shoulder Plates, as you see here. They are basically the uh, Prisma versions of these. Now, I used to have these for a long time, but now I just got these, and these look amazing. I fucking love them. You get them for both arms. Now, the knee plates aren't something really that major. You don't really need them. I just put them there just because I could. So, I end up putting left and right Prisma Endo knee plates. Now, you don't have to have them. You can have this if you want. Give it, like, a little more of a tentacly vibe to it. You could give it this. I don't know how that goes into Pennywise, but you could. Um, so, yeah, I'm working with what I got here. Um... And there's no auxiliary. I mean, I'm not going to put this on him, so whatever. Um, now, we come down to the colors. And I left this color, which is, as you see in PSIV, um, it's a light blue. It's like a sky blue kind of color. And I ended up using it. Now, if we move around, you'll see what it mostly affects. Oh, wait, these are for your attachments. I'm sorry. That's for attachments. But basically, the reason why I did that is so that... Um, because when it comes to these things, they're made out of Prisma. So, depending on what kind of colors you put down depends on the color. So, for instance, if we were to scroll down, we would change that color. And personally to me, this just looked like the best. Um, now, secondary color, we have it as that. Um, we have this in the Halloween section. Now, now I know not everyone might have the Halloween section, so you can experiment with different reds. Now, if you move around, it really doesn't change much. Um, it just seems to change the tint of the chest plate, and it seems to change the edges of the other pieces. It doesn't really change much. Um, the accents. Now, I left this in PSIV red. Um, if you look, it's the only thing that really affects is your chest plate, because the accents are this chest plate thing. So... Yeah, that's, uh, that's how it is. So you can experiment with this. Now, your attachments don't have to be the exact same colors as your Warframe. That's just what I did. Um, I experimented it with the colors. So, I mean, you don't have to have it exactly like your Warframe. Energy is white. Let's see what it does when you change it. Oh, look, see. So me, personally, I just thought it looked better as white. Now, if you want to see what it looks like in orange, just because Pennywise's arms here are orange, we can scroll down and... I mean, it looks okay. Um, I just honestly prefer the white. That's just me. Um, now we go back here. Um, this is his uh, regular colors. Um, primary, I use the Halloween color, um, as you see right there. This is the main like part of Pennywise, as you can see. Oh, wow, that green looks... Ooh, that looks... Ooh. I'm gonna have to make a character with that. Ooh, that looks nice. Ooh, I didn't know how good that green looked. Either way. Um, so yeah, that's the main color of Pennywise. You can experiment with that if you want. I don't know. 
Secondary, another PSIV, as you see, it's the secondary biggest color. Probably what secondary probably means. <coughs> Swear that hurts. To territory, we or whatever the fuck you pronounce that, that's in the Halloween colors too. It's red, it's more of a darker red. Now, all it seems to affect is this big red blood splatter that you have here and also the back part. Um, and it also seems to affect the tentacles a bit um, that he that Saren has back there. Now, if we go to accents, this is another red that I use for Halloween. And if we scroll around a bit, um, it seems to affect very little bit. It seems to mostly be around the red um, orb of blood that we have there. It seems to mostly affect like the chest and little little bits and pieces here. It's not really that major of a color. So I left that as that red in Halloween. Um, and energy, I chose PSIV in the brightest red we had. Honestly, when you see this Saren in battle, it honestly, that honestly looks perfect for this kind of character that I'm making here. Now, if we get out of here real quick, we'll go to Regalia. Now, real quick, before I go to Regalia, actually. Um, if we go to sit, uh, this, I really wanted to try to add a cape to it. It just... None of them really fit. That's just my personal opinion. None of them really seem to fit. So I didn't bother. That's why there's no cape here. Also, Pennywise doesn't have a cape, so... Um, either way, we go to Regalia. And the front sigil is the steel meridian sigil as you'll see here now what i did was that i turned the alpha all the way up i turned the rotation to one two three one two three i turned it to three away from the end so if you scroll all the way to the end and go three to the left that's the rotation now the height well it goes as high as it does um <laughs> It seems like it's only one uh, behind the default. So, I mean, that's nothing much to change. The width, as you can see, is all the way maxed. The offset and the alpha are all the way maxed. Now, the color I chose for this is another Halloween red. It's that very top corner one. I chose this because when you look at Pennywise, you kind of see that he's got this makeup on. Now, of course, I really tried to have a lot of sigils try to go into his face. This is the only sigil that I could find that I personally own that reached Saren's face. So unfortunately, this is the best I could do. I personally like it. You guys might want to change it up. I don't know. Now I go to back sigil, and this is the mastery sigil. It's right here. It looks like this. Now I really love this one. Jesus Christ. Ugh. Ugh. I'm sorry. I am so sorry. I have... I, I, I don't even know. Jesus. Either way. Um, so, for the most part, this stays basically the same. Everything is basically default. The alpha's all the way raised. The only difference is that 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. This seems to be 3 off in terms of height. Now, I really like this because it seems like it fits. Like, if you look at the black parts of his back, it seems like the sigil matches perfectly and curves with the uh, back parts. And I really like it, so that's why I chose it. Also, the fact that it has this eerie vibe where it keeps going up, like the red energy keeps going up. Now, the primary color, I believe it's the same. Yeah, it's the same as the front sigil. It's a dark red. Now... Another detail that I really loved of Saren, um, and the reason why I chose to keep Pennywise as Saren, is if you look at Saren's fingers. Now, if I can go to a wall real quick, um, so yeah, I can show you guys. Uh, right there. Now, if we look at Saren, if she would get out of her fucking animation, um, if we look at Saren... The fingertips of Saren kind of look, since I did the red that I did, look kind of like blood. Now, I really like that. It kind of looks like there's blood on, well, Pennywise's hands and all that. Not to mention that the tendrils behind him are looking like they're alive. Look, they move without him walking. The tips of it look like they're dipped in red. So, it kind of was like a nice detail. 
and that's why I chose that red is mostly for that not because of the whole you have a red orb on your thigh for some fucking reason um but yeah that was Jesus that's why I chose it now real quick I'm gonna take Saren into battle so you guys can see what Pennywise can do in battle um let's just go to earth make this faster uh I want an exterminate. Or I can't find an exterminate. Uh, I'm not grabbing that. Oh, there we go. There we go. We got E Prime. Let's go. Um, yeah, personally me, I really love the way that my Pennywise came out. I kind of made a Spider-Man version of Saren as well. Maybe I'll show you guys that next. Um... But yeah, I really like how my uh, Pennywise came out. It's it just really looks good. Now maybe in the future, if it if they come out with like a sigil that I get and it covers their face more and makes Saren look more like Pennywise, then I'll probably switch the front sigil. That's my only grief about this. Oh God. Okay, let's go. Ooh, I forgot about you. Sorry. And it really works well for me that, like, Saren is what it is when it comes to how I made them. How I made Saren because... I mean, how I made Pennywise, I'm sorry. Um, because Pe Saren is, like, a poison... Um, a poison Warframe. So, it's very capable. I really like it. Um... And it's very helpful, like, for long-range attacks and all that. So it's, like, kind of like Pennywise has uh, more powers than he already has. Get the fuck up here! There we go. Why did I come down here? Oh, yeah, there was, like, one person there. All right, down here. Or I can't see for shit. How do I... I honestly forgot how to, uh, I forgot, I, I forgot how to turn on the light, like the, they give you a little flashlight in Warframe that you can touch, and it just starts on, I forgot what button that is, I'll, I'll look it up after this video is done. Hi. Ooh. <laughs> oh man, and if especially if you make your weapons look like uh the way I taught you how to make Pennywise, oh my god, they look amazing. I probably should have put energy siphon on my Saren, but you know, or Pennywise. Probably should have done that, but whatever. Okay, fuck off you. Um, find one mod. Thank you, thank you very much. I very much appreciate it. Um, ooh, just because I leveled up, I got like a uh, new max out of uh, energy. Oh my god, that was beautiful. Alright, come up here. Ooh, 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 ooh. Alright, we only have seven more enemies to take care of. Um, I forgot, I have no more other weapons. Ooh, hi. Dude, I freaking love this sigil. Because all you can see in the shadows is the sigil. Oh my god, that is so beautiful. I don't even have to waste my time with these people. I'm just like, throw pixie dust, throw pixie dust, and you're dead. It's just so fucking beautiful. Oh, God, I love how it looks in the dark. Oh, it's so beautiful. And I sound like I'm having an orgasm. All right, come up here. Yep, and well, guys, that is my version of Pennywise in terms of Warframe. Um, don't forget to like this video if you did. Don't share this wonderful video with your friends. 
don't forget to subscribe to Kill Zom Zone for also more gaming type shit like this. And yeah, so hopefully this was helpful, I guess. I, I don't know. I'm going to try to make more characters. Um, if you guys want, you guys can like tell me, hey, why not try to make this? And I'll see if I can make it. Um, if I can, I can't. If I can, I'll try. <laughs> Either way, so with that, guys, for this wonderful video to close, Kill Zom Zone. And I am.